Porsche 718 Boxer 25 years not only honors all its predecessors, it delivers in its own right. It seems the days of the petrol engine are numbered, with four litre powerhouses like the one in this car being a last hurrah. And so, as they say, if you've got it, you should flaunt it. And this car flaunts and celebrates in equal measure. You see, it's now been a quarter of a century for Porsche's entry-level Boxster series, and we have, slightly belatedly, got the keys for this one. So, is this a badged-up Boxster? Or are we about to drive one of the very best of the breed? Well, to find out, why not join me, Roger Bailey, for a Boxster 25th birthday celebration. It was one of those where were you when moments, and I remember mine well. It was when Porsche's all-new mid-engine sports car crossed before my eyes some 25 years ago. You see, I happened to be following one during a rather mundane drive in my less than exotic Ford Escort. I was caught by the sight ahead of me of a never seen before Porsche. This new low curvy sports car looked gorgeous and went straight onto my imaginary car wish list. Wind the clock forward by a quarter of a century and the Boxster still exhibits the flair which rewrote the style book and still leads the way with more than 350,000 new owners testament to the fact that the Boxster has been an unmitigated success. And so I think it's time to take a good look at this unmitigated success, this delight from Stuttgart. It was to mark the occasion that Porsche created the Boxster, the 25 years anniversary special, and restricted its numbers to just 1,250 units worldwide, making this Boxster all the more exceptional. And also exceptional, I must say here, is Porsche Centre Chester, that most agreeable of dealerships who we thank sincerely for loaning us this great sports car. A sports car which is in essence a fourth generation Boxster GTS 4 litre model, meaning there's no need to worry too much if you can't find one of these ultra rare 25 years, as the GTS 4 litre essentially has you covered. This means our anniversary car is powered by the sublime 718 4-litre flat-six engine with 395 brake horsepower, giving the kind of power-to-rate ratio a sports car like this deserves. And a look around our example sees the most striking yet subtle feature of the 25 years Boxster, which is the nod to the colour Neodyme, a copper-like shimmering gold colour providing a contrast to the base colour, which in our case is an unusual black colour rather than the silver as most examples seem to be painted. Neodyme colour is used on the front apron, the side air intakes, as well as for the lettering and the two-tone 20-inch special alloy wheels. Inside we find deep and lustrous black leather trim and Porsche's excellent 14-way electrically adjustable sport seats. Note the box the 25 lettering and badges here and there. And a must in any box that in my opinion, a heated GT multifunction steering wheel covered in leather. These items being just some of the features included in the model's already extensive equipment list. To my eyes, this Boxster shape is as appealing as it was 25 years ago when the new baby was first revealed to us, and the shape has weathered the test of time rather nicely. And time has also been kind to our 718 cockpit, which first appeared in the previous 981 Boxster model. It being ergonomically sound, all controls are in the right places and all of a traditional high quality. And another thing of quality we note when moving off is this class-beating gear change, which is almost peerless in its precision and feel. And yet, some cars are just so satisfying, waxing lyrically does them no justice. So, what's the very first impression? Well, this engine is as smooth as silk. Gearbox, beautiful, typical Porsche gearbox. Clutch is light, and it's a delight. The punchy, naturally aspirated H6 engine's 310 foot-pounds of torque never feels too much, and it's certainly not too little. Rather, it's also incredibly linear. Mash the accelerator receiver, push that feels like it never runs out. Even as the engine starts screaming, and I mean screaming, on its way to its 7,800 RPM redline howl. Yeah, turbocharged engines can be fun, but this slightly detuned, 
GT4 stroke spider motor is hugely satisfying in its predictable, approachable explosiveness. It never feels like too much power, it's just the right amount, even though the tall gearing makes it feel easy to hit sort of illegal speeds over a course of a single cog. For the record, 0 to 62 takes just 4.5 seconds and the top speed of 180 miles per hour can be achieved with or without the roof in place. And of course, like all boxes, it's just a nine second moment before the roof comes down. And that sound and fury only comprises half of the equation. This mid-engine drop top is about as perfectly balanced as a sports car can be. The adaptive dampers ride 10 millimeters lower than the standard box, but there's still ample suspension travel to soak up most of the bothersome bumps on our roads. And so, once again, we have a triumph from those clever people at Porsche. It's not all the nice options on offer here that makes this a great car. It's what was already here. And that is an already sublime GTS from which it is formed. The added cachet of the 25 years bespoke enhancements and the 25 years exclusivity serve to add a distinct feel of that unique Porsche heritage. The four litre Boxster is a car for which I never want to hand the keys back for. They really are that good on so many levels. Added to that, this Boxster 25 edition is becoming a legend in its own lifetime. Being based on the already sublime GTS model and with its added style celebrating that very first concept car, this is a gem of a sports car in its own right. Furthermore, its limited production run and its increased desirability have ensured instant cult status. And so, should you buy one? Well, they are expensive and they are scarce. However, if you're tempted, and if you can, well, maybe you should. I know I would. So, thank you so much for watching. If you've liked this video, feel free to click the like button and feel free to subscribe if you haven't already. And comments are always welcomed. I read every single one and I'll reply to most. And if you hit this little notification bell, you'll know when I've uploaded the next video. I want to be more than just a friend I'm looking for closure So baby, pull me closer Closer Help me I don't want to be just a one-night stand I'm looking for closure So baby, pull me closer Closer